Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Fluctus channel. Ever wonder when the hum of a jet engine replaced the whirring sound of prop planes? Also known as piston engine aircraft, propeller planes were the primary form of air transportation from the early 1900s through the mid 20th century. They utilized a combustion engine that turned a propeller to generate thrust. However, with the advent of the jet engine in the mid 20th century, the demand for propeller planes began to decline. Jet engines offered significant advantages over them, including faster speeds, higher altitudes, and smoother flights. But the evolution of those jet engines is a fascinating story of innovation. The first iterations of the jet engine suffered from a range of issues, such as poor fuel efficiency, excessive noise, and limited range. Over time, engineers and scientists worked to address these problems and improve the technology. They experimented with different materials, designs, and combustion processes that gradually refined the engines to make them more efficient, reliable, and powerful. Much of that fine-tuning and trial and error was done by engineers employed by General Electric. GE is one of the world's largest manufacturers of jet engines. The company has several facilities worldwide, including in Auburn, Alabama, where the impressive GE9X engine is produced. This turbofan jet engine was developed in 2013 for the use on the Boeing 777X wide-body airliner. It's the world's largest and most powerful jet engine boasting a massive 134-inch diameter fan and producing 105,000 pounds of thrust. The engine features a range of advanced technologies, including 3D printed parts, ceramic matrix composites, and materials that improve fuel efficiency and reduce emissions. The GE9X also incorporates digital controls and sensors that provide real-time performance data. After extensive testing and certification processes, the engine was approved for commercial use in 2020 Much of that testing happened at GE's Peebles test operation in Ohio. Here, it faced multiple ground and flight tests with evaluating its performance and durability. The ground tests involved simulating various operating conditions such as high-altitude flights on a specially modified Boeing 747-400 aircraft. The engine was also put through extreme temperatures and heavy rain to ensure that the engine could perform reliably under all circumstances. This extensive TechMat program is all about producing the mature product that we've committed to our customers, whether they're Boeing or whether they're the individual airlines. 
The tests allow GE to identify any issues or areas for improvement in the engine design, which could be addressed before the engine entered service on the Boeing 777X aircraft. Another well-known company, Rolls-Royce, has been at the forefront of designing and manufacturing high-performance jet engines. One of its latest is the Pearl 15. Like the GE9X, it is also a turbofan engine. But this one is designed to power the newest generation of business jets, such as the Dassault Falcon. All at Rolls-Royce, I think, very proud of being selected by Dassault for their, their flagship product. The Pearl 15 engine has a thrust output of 15,000 pounds and features a highly efficient design that allows it to reduce fuel consumption and emissions while providing maximum power. That's thanks to its hollow titanium wide cord fan blade. The fan blade is one of the most critical components of a turbofan engine, as it is responsible for drawing in and compressing the air that will ultimately be burned with fuel to generate thrust. The wide cord fan blade design is characterized by a wider and more curved profile than traditional fan blades, which allows it to compress a larger volume of air with each rotation. This can result in improved efficiency and noise reduction. The use of titanium in the fan blade construction offers several benefits as well, including a high strength to weight ratio, excellent resistance to corrosion and fatigue, and good heat resistance. The hollow design further reduces weight while maintaining structural integrity. Rolls-Royce's manufacturing facilities in the UK, specifically the Discs and Blades facility in Derby, produce these fan blades. The process starts with creating a digital model of the blade, which is then used to create a physical mold. Using a process known as lost wax casting, the blade is built and finished using a combination of robotic and human touch. Each blade undergoes extensive testing to ensure its reliability and performance. The testing program includes both ground testing and flight testing to simulate a wide range of operating conditions and environments. During ground testing, the fan blade is subjected to various loads and conditions to simulate the stresses it will experience during flight. This includes high-speed testing to measure the blade's aerodynamic performance vibration testing to measure its structural integrity, and thermal testing to ensure it can withstand extreme temperatures. Flight testing is also an essential part of the testing program. The fan blade is installed on an engine and the engine is mounted on an aircraft for flight testing. During flight testing, the blade's performance is monitored to ensure it meets the necessary standards for reliability and efficiency from takeoff to landing.
Rolls-Royce continues to look to the future of flight and is producing hybrid and electric engines as part of its commitment to reducing the environmental impact of aviation. Like hybrid and electric cars, which barely make a sound as they roll down the street. Hybrid and electric engines on planes are also quieter than traditional jet engines. In the hybrid electric category, Rolls-Royce is developing engines that combine conventional jet engines with electric motors and batteries. These engines can switch between traditional jet power and electric power, depending on the needs of the aircraft. Rolls-Royce is currently working on the E-Fan X project in partnership with Airbus and Siemens, which involves retrofitting a regional aircraft with a hybrid electric propulsion system. In the all-electric category, Rolls-Royce is developing engines that rely solely on electric power. The company is focusing on applications for smaller aircraft, such as air taxis, where the shorter range and lower power requirements make all electric propulsion systems more viable. The Spirit of Innovation is the name of the first all-electric aircraft developed by Rolls-Royce. The aircraft is part of the company's Acel project, which aims to develop the world's fastest all-electric aircraft. Lighter means faster, and the spirit of innovation certainly fits that description. It features a lightweight airframe made of carbon fiber and a highly efficient electric propulsion system that includes three electric motors and a 6,000 cell battery pack. The aircraft has a top speed of 300 miles per hour and can fly up to 200 miles on a single charge. Before the spirit of innovation took flight, it underwent extensive testing, including wind tunnel tests with computer simulations and ground testing of the aircraft's electric motors and battery system. By September 2021, it was ready for its maiden flight and the spirit of innovation successfully completed it at the UK's Ministry of Defence Boscombe Down site. Total air time was 15 minutes and the plane reached a top speed of 150 miles per hour. The spirit of innovation represents a major milestone in the development of all electric aircraft and showcases Rolls-Royce's expertise in electric propulsion systems. The project has also highlighted the potential of electric aircraft to reduce emissions and noise pollution and usher in a new era of sustainable aviation. We have covered the crazy evolution of jet engines powering the world's largest airplanes. From the cutting-edge engine technology of General Electric and its GE9X engine, the world's largest and most powerful commercial aircraft engine, to Rolls-Royce's Pearl 15 engine, which features a lightweight, hollow titanium, wide-cord fan blade. All of these engines underwent rigorous testing at manufacturing facilities before becoming the horsepower that powers airplanes all over the world. As the aviation industry moves towards more sustainable solutions, Rolls-Royce is also transitioning towards hybrid and electric engines culminating in aircraft like the speedy spirit of innovation. Who knows? In the future, noise pollution will be gone and emissions will go way down as we all take to the skies in electric planes.
That's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of our new content. See you next time.